Good evening. Um, the noise you hear in the background is my air purifier going and my humidifier going and the air conditioner. Um, and um, if you could um, bear with me, um, all day my breathing was okay. But towards the evening hours, it started getting really bad and it's really bad right now. Um, so um, I'm sorry if I have to pause. Tonight's daily devotional is from Genesis 19, verse 17. And it came to pass, when they had brought them forth abroad, that he said, Escape for thy life, look not behind thee, neither stay thou in all the plain. Escape to the mountain, lest thou be consumed. <coughs> Excuse me. It's impossible to forget we are sinners. All of us, all of us, We've all made poor life decisions or sinned against God, causing hurt to people we love. Sorry. Sorry. It's easy to allow regret to seep into our hearts and make us feel as though we can never overcome our terrible actions. Regret over our sinful nature is natural, but we must remember that Jesus paid it all so that we may be forgiven. God's love is so unconditional. The slate is wiped clean when we ask for forgiveness. In Jesus' name, we are forgiven. Lord, please forgive me and my brothers and sisters our sin and my family and their families and make our lives new through your spirit. In Jesus' name, amen. No, especially... You know, Satan, he's a, him and his demons, they're, they're out there and, you know, they try to attack, putting those thoughts into our head, things maybe we used to do, the life we used to lead before we gave our life to Jesus. But we have to remember, when we accept Jesus as Lord and Savior and we believe, you are forgiven and God sees your heart. And if you stumble, stand back up. If you stumbled and you feel bad that you stumbled, you feel bad that you hurt God, that's the Holy Spirit convicting you and indwelling in you. Stand back up. Our Heavenly Father loves us. Jesus loves us. And we can see the day approaching where we are going to be face to face with our Heavenly Father and our Savior, King Jesus. And we're all going to meet each other when we're home. I don't know if you guys are watching the um, RNC. I'm watching it bits and pieces here and there. Too much singing for me. But um, tonight's a bad breathing night for me. So um, I'm ready for my new healthy body too. Praise the Lord. I, I just, it's weird. I don't know what's going on with me. I just don't. And now I have this ear infection. Um, they're going to call in new antibiotics because this one doesn't seem to be working. Um, but, you know, that's just Satan trying to attack me. But I'm like, <laughs> I'm pushing your buttons, ain't I? So, where does a badge of honor family when you, when you go through illness and financial problems and um, whatever you go through, you know. You're pushing Satan's buttons. Jesus will get you through. And we're all meeting at the marriage supper. So, remember, your sins are forgiven when you accept Jesus as Lord and Savior and you walk with Christ. Good night. God bless you, and I'll talk to you soon.